a road trip today. So excited. We're visiting M. Chibizi Hospital and the Bible College that's there too. We don't really know what's in store, but we have a longer drive than normal. And it's gonna be an adventure. Well, hello there. Thanks for joining us. We're driving on the road to Chebesi to visit the Chebesi Mission Hospital, which is super exciting because the Meeting House has been funding this project for several years, and we're gonna check in on the progress there. We're driving with our driver for the day, which is Gopar, the MCC rep in Zimbabwe. Hello. And he is driving on the right side of the vehicle. In case you're wondering. I'm asking our team, what is one word that you are feeling as we head into the day? Mark? Hopeful. Laura? Curious. Zenzo, one word. Excited. Excited? We have just had the privilege of being part of a BIC Bible College morning with a chapel experience, a tour around their facilities, and then tea time with the students and some of the lecturers. This Bible Institute is actually where many of the BIC pastors in Zimbabwe are trained, and it's so evident that they just have such a passion to go out and to reach their community and to train pastors to go out and serve in rural areas and to equip them to be able to do that. We've just learned that the students here at Mchibese Bible College have a soccer field and maybe they would like a soccer ball. So we're going to attempt, no pressure, no performance anxiety here. We're just going to pump up the soccer ball. I am at Mchibese Hospital in Zimbabwe. I actually can't believe I'm here because I have been hearing about this place for years, knowing that this hospital receives meeting house funds through MCC. As a result of our partnership with this hospital, they have a doctor on staff here. And it's been so encouraging to just walk around and to see the facilities that they have here. The healthcare system in Zimbabwe is not like it is in Canada. And so it actually does cost to come here, a very small amount for patients to receive care. But what we did learn is that children under five and seniors over 60 get to visit uh, and have a consultation with the doctor for free. There are still so many challenges that need to be overcome at the hospital, um, but it's great to see MCC working closely with the people who are making decisions and encouraging them to learn from neighboring hospitals so that they can improve their local operations. Access to healthcare is so important, especially in rural communities like this, where major cities and hospitals are kilometers and kilometers away. Mitsubishi Hospital actually started as a child and maternity care center and has grown to include healthcare around HIV and AIDS uh, and all kinds of other things. Now, at a rural hospital like this called Mitsubishi, and we're done. We're done. We just made a video for AIDS care. But won't, we won't even need to show anyone for six months. It's kind of crazy, but we are planners. We're on it. It's been a great day. See you tomorrow. Good night.